I think it's down. Yep, in the air. How are we supposed to, uh, how, <laughs> how are we supposed to deal with this again? This is how everybody was going out the other day looking for them Black Friday deals, all in a rush <laughs> with their hair messed up and stuff. Gotta get to the stove, get a cheap laptop. <laughs> What's happening, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of ARK, where we have uh, just got back from a little break IRL. Well, I did at least. And man, is there some cool stuff on the map. Look at that Chaos Rex down there. Now listen, I know my Celestial is going to be like such a good match for this. I, I wish that we can tame Chaos. We can't yet. I know you can, but we can't yet. I've never tamed the Chaos. I'd like to have one. But it's a great opportunity to test out my little Celestial Rex. And look, we got a Demonic Shine Horn on the map. Not that I'm going to tame it. Listen, I thought about it and I was like... Man, a demonic shine horn would be kind of cool, but there's also a celestial argent on the map, and that's what I'm more concerned with. Also, what is that down there? What is that? I can't see with your wings, baby. Dang it! It's always something. Uh, it's just an alpha aloe, no problem at all. Okay, let's get let's get at a safe range so we can pull out pull out direction. Pull out the Rex and see what we can do here. There's the chaos, okay. Let's go ahead and just, uh-huh. 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 And uh-huh, all right. Power up. Oh, that's the sound of power. What you want, baby? You want some? Rex on Rex action. Oh, okay. All right, that's the way you want to put it. Man, we all in the trip. That's some fire that he put on the napalm breath. Oh, that's ignorant. <laughs> I like it though. I like it. Look, because I was uh, because I was buffed. There was no problem. There was no problem in the napalm. I just stood and it was just doing damage to me. No burn, no nothing. Oh my god, this Rex is so stupid. <laughs> so stupid, powerful. Excuse me, guys. Break it up. Break it up up here. We're trying to have a nice conversation and now the poison. Oh my gosh. Anyway, I hope y'all had a great Thanksgiving for those of you that celebrate it. If not, I hope y'all got some good deals on Black Friday. Cyber Monday is coming up. It's some good stuff too. I'm ready for the Christmas season altogether, y'all. I don't know about y'all, but it's just, it's a lot of fun. Okay. For me at least. So this Celestial Argentavis, that's, that's going to be... That's going to be our mission today. And it shouldn't be that bad, but when we get it, we'll test it out and stuff. Let's go ahead and put the Rex up. Um, why not? There we go. All righty. <laughs> and the, let's, let's go ahead and search for it. I'm not, I was searching for Demonic to see what the, the, you know, with competition. Every time I go to make kibble, I think to myself, Demonic, Celestial, Demonic, Celestial. And Celestial usually wins. Not that I'm not fond of Demonic creatures because I really like them, but there's some of them that just aren't uh, all they're cracked up to be. I got a Demonic roll. Right. Look, a Celestial Aloe, 140. You know, we're so close. Let's take a look at it. But And we'll get, we'll get some hide from it too. But honestly, when it really comes down to it, man, I... <laughs> I, 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 I I, I did a demonic roll rat a little while back, and it was horrible. <laughs> like, I thought that it would have some sort of special power. No, it's just really powerful. And I've seen some cool stuff, like the demonic, um, what's the anteater? You know what I'm talking about. It's not one of my favorite dinos. Anyway, they're very powerful. Very, very, very powerful. But nothing that uh, nothing that makes me say, man, we have to get one of those. Now, I know I can kill this thing with um, my my bird here. I'm not even worried about it. But but we have the opportunity to, to use the Celestial Rex. Why not, you know? Why not? And we just move so fast and stuff. All right, bring it, baby. They're fast, too. By the way, thank you all for the umpteen corrections that I got about the health stat i was i was a zero off guys look so that's a lot of digits we're looking at three eight two four one eight seven six that's a whole mil that's that's a that's a whole 38 million that is not 3.8 million so i get it all right i get it thank y'all thank y'all for the reminders okay 
<laughs> Sometimes it's just I glance at it, man. Sometimes I just glance. All right, let's go ahead and... Oh, what's going on here? What just... Oh, there was a scorpion apparently. All right. Well, at least it didn't eat this. Okay, I don't... Oh, you know what? I forgot my... Uh... I usually I usually bring my Therizinosaur. I did not. It might be worth going get it and coming back. But something is going to eat it. You know what? I'm just going to go ahead and just take the Celestial Hide that I get from there. I, I can't. I, I, I don't want it to get eaten by an origin or whatever. I don't see any around. But y'all know how Ark is. That's my bad for not bringing it. Anyway. Celestial Aloe is done. Let's look for the Celestial Argentavis now, which is, I believe, a little bit to the west of us. If my client, whatever, yeah, there we go. <laughs> it's it's a little bit of a, uh, so that's a Celestial Argent, and that's a Celestial Rex, okay. Um, it's a little bit of a, a lag fest when I opened that program. It happened to us all on the servers that we play on, as well as single player. It's just one of those things that the, the mod is not perfect. But it's so convenient that I wouldn't dream of not playing without it in a map like this. When you go on for tames and stuff. Anyway. Uh, there she is. Oh, and there he is, too. Oh, no. This is not good. Um... How much hit points do you have? Oh gosh! All right, with that Argent, that's this is this is bad. We need we need the Rex once again. I know it just seems like we just keep we just keep Rexing out here, but listen, it's him, it's him, it's die. We don't want to lose the opportunity to to tame this Celestial Argent, so we're gonna go out and let's buff up again. Uh-huh. The origin is a good bit away. It's good. Uh-huh. Let's fight, big boy. Normally, I would be afraid that this thing would dismount me, but it doesn't. Uh-oh. There's that celestial right there. There we go. Okay, let's just turn back around. Yep, you can't get dismounted on a Celestial, ladies and gentlemen. It is broken. <laughs> Not to say it's broken, but I think we can all agree that um, it really, really sucks getting dismounted. Whether you're a small level or whatever. There's nothing like just being on a, a you know, a mount and just riding around and, and getting, you know, a, a, a mount with 38 million hit points, right? And uh, getting dismounted by a raptor in the middle of everything—it's, it's, it's ignorant. Okay, <laughs> let's uh, let's put the poison pteranodon down now. Excuse me, pteranodon. Let me go. Now look, I don't have a problem here if you don't let me go. Okay, celestial, perfect. Is there anything good in there that left? I mean, we'll take some blood and some hide. I'll take it, I guess. All right. So, the argent. We got to take a look at its its health first. Also, I always forget because it's been a few days since I recorded. I always forget how much damage we do. Okay, that was about 15 grand. Okay, no problem. I always forget how much damage we do, and then I think to myself, is it gonna be okay to hit this thing? I'm sure for the Argentavis it will be. It shouldn't be a problem to tell you the truth. But alrighty. What kind of health pool do you have? Should be good. Oh, 442 grand? Yes. Okay, we'll hit you once, twice, three times a birdie. Okay, hold on. Let's take a look now. Where you at? Where you at, torp wise? Oh, spikes of doom! <laughs> Spike. So that's the you just witnessed the Argent's special power. You just witnessed the Argent's special power. It uh it it has the potential to do a lot of damage with that attack. Uh-huh. Like that one right there? Yep, that hurts. That hurts, babe. Hold on, hold on. We got 
We got what we need. Oh, no. We got what we need here. How about I just hit it until it goes to sleep, huh? I think it's down. Yep, in the air. Well. How are we supposed to, uh... How... <laughs> How are we supposed to deal with this again? Uh, there... <laughs> hmm. Let's see here. There has to be something we could do. Uh, I, I know for a fact that putting on kibble, like, in the air as we kind of... Uh, that ain't gonna work at all. I need to be able to fly. Uh, man. <laughs> or, or climb, uh, as it were. Hmm. Let's see what I got. All right, we got the stuff. <laughs> we we have the stuff to make this happen. It's gonna be ignorant. It's a little dark out. I brought I brought some work lights just in case we needed them. Okay, let's see here. Let's let's just set up one of our little work lights right quick. Uh huh. Beautiful. All right, that should give us some some place to work. Let's just turn that on. All right, let's see what we got here. I feel like I'm an old, old mechanic or something. All right, let's see. Get right underneath this sucker. Uh-huh. We're going to place another light right here. The lights are just novelty, guys. I'm just trying to put on a show, okay? Because I realize it's ignorant, all right? I do realize it's ignorant. Okay. Um, all right. Now. Now. Now to get down to business. Okay. We got... Um, uh-huh. Let's just... Okay. Good. Good. Yep. Thatch foundations, baby, all the way to the top. You can pillar just like in Minecraft. I know, I'm a genius. Um, what's that? You think that I should have a tech suit backpack because I'm like level 90? Listen, I don't know if I'm level 90. Am I level 90? I'm level 94. Okay, I'm an embarrassment. Listen, I don't have uh, one of those, um, the thing to build it. I have the tech stuff though. I need to get to it and I just pooed on it. All right. Beautiful. Yes. Yes. All right. Almost there. And we can access it now. All right. One more work light for good measure, huh? One more. I did make another kibble, by the way. There we go. All right. <laughs> now, now we got something going here. All right. Let's see what we got. Um. So let's put a few of the kibble. Oh. Th oh. Oh. Okay, whoa, give it, wait, give it all back, give it all back, give it all back. <laughs> I still got four left over. I had plenty, man. I had plenty. Okay, well, we could take down, we could take down this, uh, <laughs> we can take down this whole shebang here. And let's put the Argent in. Oh, look how beautiful you are. Level 142. Ah, uh, wait, let me see if I can get the health number right. 676,000 and one. All right, that's a point zero, okay? Point zero. Let's go home and make a saddle after I uh, after I demo all this. Do we have even a demo gun on us? Demo, yeah, we do. We do. Hey, we still had six foundations to spare too. This is as fast as you could pill her down. This is this was actually a nice system. I'm glad. I'm glad I did it. It was fun. <laughs> All right, let's do a little bit of housekeeping and uh, let's make that celestial saddle, shall we? We're taking a look at celestial Argentavis. See, we still have enough for some kibble too. Uh, getting a little low on primal blood, which shouldn't be a problem since now we have things to kill them relatively quickly. And uh, we're looking for a celestial Argentavis saddle, which is gonna take 1500 hide. I do not think <laughs> we have enough of that. We're gonna have to kill another celestial. Which is, shouldn't be a problem to tell you the truth. We have plenty of stuff, so let's hunt one down. All right, this should be relatively easy. I mean, oh, look how pretty too. I wish you can mate them, guys. I really wish you can mate them. I was so distraught when y'all told me in the comments last episode that we couldn't mate them. Oh, I was so upset, man. I was like, God dog it, that is gonna suck. I thought I just got a hundred tamer helpers right there. It was something different. Guess what I remembered to bring this time? Uh-huh. The Therizina. And we hit with the C attack to get all that beautiful hide. 
And we head on back and we make what we got now. All right, let's go with the saddle creation now. We did a little bit of resource running and now we're ready to go, Argent. There we go. Celestial Argentava saddle, babe. Beautiful. And let's go ahead and put it on. Man, I really, I really wish you could breed these guys. But it's okay. We'll get straight to leveling. That's all right with me. Saddle. Oh, my God. Let's see much help. Oh, ho, ho, ho. it's beautiful. Let's give you some XP potions to get you right as rain immediately. And, of course, we're going to follow this up by going to um, visit our friend, the Centaurian. Let's go ahead and bring up, and we'll count the zeros accordingly this time. Let's do, yeah, uh, let's see, That's is that 15 million? That is 15 million. Okay, good deal. And, um, well, yes, hold on. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh. Yep, yeah, it's 15 million. Okay. <laughs> let's do, let's, let's just do uh, the rest in melee, I think. Uh, we need some in stamina as well. I forgot the crazy stamina requirements of these guys. All right, and that should be pretty good to go. Oh my God, the the blood on its feathers actually looks kind of cool. Let's let's go ahead and give it a fabled health potion, and we should just be fine right now. Oh, the red's clearing up, and look at how beautiful, guys. Oh man, it was worth the wait. So you guys want to see what it can do? Pretty sure. It is C. It's been a little while. Nope. It's X. Yep, that's it. That's it. So, basically, what this does... Let me see if I could give you guys a a look from the side. I'm going to I'm gonna uh, pull out a little bit here. The way that this works is that when you're facing a certain way, like I'm facing forward right now, right? If you press X... It goes out and down and as y'all can see the the area of effect is just it's nuts man it is really really nuts so by you looking down for instance let's see if I think that I'm gonna be able to hit this guy and I hit X you see how it's almost going behind me it's a little bit different to try to aim so if I would want to hit this guy right in front of me what I would do is I would look straight ahead, sort of like this, and then hit X. And it's kind of like a bombing effect. So that does 127k damage to, oh my goodness, man. Uh, I mean, like a very, very, very large area. It has uh, almost no stamina left after those. After those, it has almost no stamina left. It still has the power up like we saw before. Uh-huh. <laughs> and um, the, the, the lack of being able to be debuffed in that state is amazing. We should get a costume for it because, honestly, it's a little slow, you know? And I, I would rather just put more points into other stuff besides movement speed. So let's go ahead and get one of those handled. There it is. We'll do 300 speed. That should be plenty, to tell you the truth. And we'll go ahead and put that right on your costume slot. And you should be... Oh, baby. That's really nice. The weather is horrible. <laughs> like, very, very, very bad. But we're doing it. And let's go see our buddy. I don't even think we're going to have to waste much time with this, guys. X. And levels. Thank you. Thank you. Only seven <laughs> because we used all those potions on it or whatever, but... I think it's safe to say that we want a little bit more stamina as well as a couple more points in melee and this should be wonderful. Now that it's powered up, let's see what it's got guys. Let's see what it's got. Let's go ahead and... Uh huh. Only 58,000 damage to that origin. But it's like the electricity keeps hitting it. How much uh, How much health does it have? 122 million. We only did a couple million points of damage here. What we're probably going to want to do is go down and just peck it. Oh, yeah. We're doing 220,000 apiece. 
let's see. I am going to go ahead and get up here so I can keep it knocked back. I have to watch my uh, stamina here. But yeah, we're doing pretty good on it right now. Let's see. 107. Oh my god. This is still going to take a very, very, very long time. Okay. How about this? Let's 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 trade out a little bit here. Let's trade out here. Uh huh. I need to eat some food. <laughs> I need to eat some food. It's the attack of the celestials, guys. The Argent is still gonna be really, really slow here because 144 million. It's the damage on it is pretty impressive though for a flyer. It's pretty great, but I do think. Well, actually, it's it's stronger than my Rex. The, the only thing, the only difference about this is this thing will probably never hit. This thing will probably never hit my Rex. Man, comparatively, yeah. <laughs> I, I, the Rex didn't, the Rex can't even hold a, well, oh, wait, 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 hold on. Yeah, that's a little bit better. <laughs> that's a little bit better. Honestly, the knockback is a little bit concerning. Can we can we corner this guy to where I can just hit you a few times without it? Without yeah, there we go. All right, I was about to say. You know, now thinking about it, that Allosaurus would probably be pretty crazy too with the amount of speed that it can get. I really wish we could see the fight without seeing all these numbers. Yeah, I do think the Argent is gonna be faster. Honestly. <laughs> I do think the Argent will be faster. We should get them both out here. Oh no! It fell! Well, now's our chance, I suppose. I suppose now's our chance. Let's go ahead and power down here. How could this go wrong? <laughs> How could this go wrong? Would uh, probably going in the water or something like that? Hold on, you know what I can do? I can summon the Argent. I can get on the Rex. And we could have we can have a, a dual showdown. Oh yeah, baby. Get in there and show it who's boss, baby. Alright, now we got the Argent attacking it. And <laughs> the Rex. Celestials versus or uh origin. I don't even know what I'm saying no more. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. You saw that? Moving all the way down from the mountains now. But at least the bird will be able to get some good hits on it now. Do your special, birdie. Do your special. You see? You see how I have that uh, debuff? Watch. Well, it doesn't actually take it away. <laughs> but it does prevent it from happening again. How are we doing now? How's the Argent, too? Origin Corno has 44 million health left. Oh, we just fine. We're just fine. <laughs> we ain't got we 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 ain't got nothing to worry about here. Except time. Think we got it on the run. Think we got it on the run now. Yeah! <laughs> Come on, baby. Don't you go in the water? Don't you go in the water. You know my bird won't go in the water after you, huh? Hold on. This turning costume is such an advantage, dude. Like, I have so much maneuverability on the Rex. It's, it's, it's nuts. Alright. How much? Uh, you only have a little bit less than 10 million health left. Okay, time to power up again. Insufficient stamina. Well, maybe I ought to get that fixed, huh? Couple million health left. We should be approaching the end here. Being that origins still take this long, y'all, and we have to kill so many more, I think it's time to go again. Again. I think it's time to upgrade again. We have a lot of boss essence. 
We do. And now with the origin blood that we have, we could probably make a fabricated sniper rifle and the origin bullets, I think they're called, which can pretty much one shot trank anything. Let's go ahead and get back on the origin. And look, we didn't lose hardly any health. Like nothing, man. Nothing. And we still, we got a couple of nice pieces of armor too. Well, it is super, super powerful, but at the level that we at, I still want more. At any rate, I'm very glad I tamed it. I hope you guys really enjoyed this episode. If you did, give me some dab on that like button to show you support. And you can subscribe to the channel for more daily videos. Thanks so much for watching. As always, this is Ulgin signing off. And we'll see you next time. Break it down.